Hey everyone, Technomentor here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix your media and purchase account has been disabled if you're getting this error message on your iPhone, iPad, or Apple device. So let's get started. So very first thing when you're seeing this that you want to verify in your setting, tap on the Apple ID account here. And you're going to go down where it says Media and Purchases. You're going to tap on there and then click on View Account. You may need to sign into your Apple ID account. And from there on, what you're going to do is go ahead and click on Manage Payments right up top here. So we're going to click on Manage Payments. Now in the Manage Payment here, you want to make sure you have a payment card on file. Sometimes if your card expired or if your address, billing address has changed, you need to update it because your account can't process your card information. It happens, you know, when you get a new card or your card got, card got replaced. So make sure you enter the detail again and verify that you have a basically a valid payment on file. And once you verify, you're gonna go back. You also wanna make sure your country and region hasn't changed. Make sure it's the one that you're locally in. So you're gonna make sure that is correct as well. With those correct, you should be able to now see that error go away. Now, if it doesn't go away, the next thing to do is go into your, again, on your Apple ID account here. You're gonna go all the way down. You're gonna go ahead and sign out and sign back in. So you tap on sign out, uh, just sign out, don't erase phone and then sign back in. So when you do that, when you sign in and out, it will verify your account is good standing and fix that for you. Now, if you're still having the issue, the next thing to do is make sure your account doesn't have to be reactivated, or you might wanna go reactivate your account if it's still disabled. So in order to do that, you're gonna to go to any browser, it doesn't matter, and then Google search reactivate Apple ID. When you do that, one of the very first options is gonna be if your account is Lock, not active or disable, which is Apple's website. That will take you to their direct website. And if you go down a little bit further, this section here addresses the issue. If your media and purchase account has been disabled, uh, you can request the activation. So you're gonna go ahead and click on this link. Uh, you're gonna go ahead and sign in and then click on get started to enable accounts. So you're gonna follow through the steps here. For example, sign in and then it will prompt you to verify some information. And then from there on, you'll be able to reactivate your account. So you'll basically go over here, uh, pick whichever this applies to you. So if you have issues with purchasing app, downloading, updating, the matter, you're gonna hit continue and then follow through the prompt. The prompt will change and then eventually it'll say your account is enabled. And sometimes it could take 24 hours to 48 hours uh, for them to reactivate your account. If there's any issues, they'll let you know through your email as well so you can correct it. So that's how you fix that issue. I hope this video is helpful. So please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.